So here's the new SDMC. This is a HDMI stick with the ARM Cortex A5. You can see right here. This is the ArmLogic S805. So it's not too hot. It's been running for the last half hour. But it's still kind of cold, which is the most important about the quad-core ARM Cortex A5. And uh, you can see the UI right here. Uh, this is basic UI that SDMC has with uh, all these different things over here. Play Store and uh, the menu is down here. You can go advanced, but then it doesn't show the version. But uh, they say it's 4.4. I'm pretty sure it's 4.4 uh, with Mali 450, 4 GB flash, 1 GB RAM. It has H.265, 1080p hardware decode video, which is uh, cool for low bandwidth 1080p content. And then here, this this part here is uh, dual band Wi-Fi, kind of like plastic, so it's good good reception. The antennas on this side, and this one is metallic. So the idea is they could, there is an extender can be included for plugging it to any TV, but otherwise it can just go to, on the back of the TV, and it supports all the DRM, uh, Verimatrix, Play Ready, Widevine, Miracast, DLNA. AirPlay, Wi-Fi display, and all these things, and also, also there's some apps on Android that allow for Android phones and iOS and stuff to remote control this, which is kind of like the idea when, if you go back a little bit, you can see, uh, for example, they preload some games. Oh, right now I'm going into mouse mode. So if I go into the games, there is this game, for example. And it's, it's not being controlled with this remote because this one doesn't have a, a G sensor, but it could have, but then uh, it's being controlled by the phone. So you have to pair up the phone first and then you can play these games, So which is, which is a kind of cool thing. So you just pair any phone you want and suddenly your phone is a really kind of like a usable joystick.